Hello and welcome to another edition of the Wine Down Video Blogs. I am your host Ben Franco, owner of Wine Down Cafe. Um, today we have a rosé for you. It's getting to be that season. It is May, so definitely the uh, uh, rosés are starting to roll in. Uh, this one I just picked up at the Wine Missing Wine and Spirits store. This is, uh, I think, it doesn't give me exactly percentage-wise, but it is a Sangiovese uh, rosé, so I'm going to assume it's at least 85% Sangiovese. Um, and it is uh, Bernard uh, Griffin. Uh, it's coming in at 10.99, 2013 rosé from Columbia Valley. Uh, Columbia Valley uh, basically is in Washington and Oregon. This is coming from the Washington side. Kind of like a kind of warm, uh, actually uh, for the Pacific uh, Northwest, uh, it's kind of like a, a warmer uh, with uh, cooler nights, uh, so the grapes do enjoy that. Uh, let's take a look at the color on this guy. Um, interesting little amount of fizz going on in there. Uh, I don't know what that is. That's, uh, that's interesting. But uh, so, like almost like a salmon color, maybe um, a tinge on the kind of like strawberry. Um, uh, more like I said, that like an orange tinge too in there as well. Let's give a little swirl and a sniff. Uh, strawberries and cranberries uh, right away coming through. A little bit of melon. This is a really, really, um, there's a lot going on in this nose actually. It's uh, very floral. Um, really floral. There's, um, there's honey, there's strawberry, there's the cranberry. There's some kind of a melon component as well. Really nice nose. Those um, those flavors kind of continue, continue on that cranberry. There's almost like a little bit of an orange component coming through. Um, cranberry acidity, I would say uh, medium minus, um, but really tasty, really nice, a uh, little nice little rosé. And again, something different coming from the Sangiovese grape. Um, really interesting. I don't know what the uh, what that was on the beginning, the uh, kind of particulate that I was seeing, because it's kind of, whatever it was, was kind of dissipated. So it could have just been a little bit of, uh, kind of just uh, a little bit of uh, fermented, uh, maybe a little bit of the yeast left over or something, uh, something going on, but uh, seems to have cleared up right away, uh, whatever it was. Actually, let's, let's pour a little more and see if it, uh, see if it comes back. Yeah, it must have just been on the beginning of that. Um, something must have been resting on the top, some kind of sediment of some sort, but it uh, seems to have cleared up. But um, all in all, really, really nice wine uh, for $10.99. Um, begin your summer of rosé early and uh, start drinking. Um, these, are again, are very food-friendly wines. Uh, and if you... Uh, uh, there's still time to get into our rosé class uh, coming uh, coming next, next week, I believe. So... Uh, uh, sign up for that. All right, we'll see you next time on the Wind Down Video Blogs.